what's up Chris Gossip? Welcome back to Pet Train Baby Tomega, the Halloween special pets! At long last, our Gloomthorn pack pet is here! The jack-o'-lantern pet, and he looks, well, she, because it's a queen, looks lean, mean, and ready to go. Look at that pet, it is awesome. I might have liked to have had it flying better, but that's all right. It, it can be on the ground like that because it would make a really good garden pet. You can put that to the edge of your garden and scare. Talk about a scarecrow. Hoo ha! Look at that pumpkin. All right, let's take a look and see what it has. I am just so excited. I, I'm almost talking too fast. It has an epic in there, which I don't know what it is, and a couple of ultra rares. The rest are commons and rares, and I thought it might have a little bit more than that, but that's okay. Because it's got quite a lot of power in the stats department. 215 intellect and 200 is its lowest stat with will and power. For race, oh my goodness. For race, it has an epic, another epic, and an ultra rare. So it has two epics and an ultra rare. I wouldn't have thought a pumpkin would be a racer, but apparently they mean to make this a racer. It also has the much and long awaited Headless Horseman card. We're going to be going over that very, very soon. For now, let's go ahead and train this pet up to its teen level and see what it gets. I can't wait. I love the little boingy motion. Look, boing, boing, boing. <laughs> I love it. Okay, let's go train this pet up to teen and see what it gets, and I will be right back. And here we are with Queen Zoe's teen level. As usual, I'm not very satisfied with the name. I don't think that it fits the pet very much, so I will very likely be changing this pet's name. And I wish, I wish, I wish that you could change it to whatever you wanted because I would be naming this pet something like Cannonball. Listen to him, Kamala's Cannon, or her, whatever. I am sorry, that's just straight vicious, I love it. <laughs> straight vicious. I'd be naming it, I don't know, Metalhead or Cannonball or something like that. That's a very, I mean, that's, that, you can't be any more Halloween than that. All right, let me go ahead and I know that he likes the death snack, so let's give it that. Death Boon already got freaking extra damage. You know it. Death Boon. It's not the best damage, but it's better than no damage. I got dead in. Add barrier to current lane. 30 second cooldown. I have two. I actually got <clears throat> in the pack opening two of these, so I may train the second one if I don't like the talents on the first one. We'll have to see how it goes. All right, I will be right back with Zoe's adult level. And here we are back again. Zoe is just about ready to go to adult and has been, I must say, performing magnificently. I have never had a pet that was so enthusiastic about bashing itself into blocks as this pet is. And by that I mean, whenever I hit blocks with this pet, it seems like it takes down more of them th than usual. A smaller pet with a bigger area of destruction. Look at that. I mean, that's every one of them. One shot, one kill. You cannot ask for more than that. I, I think that should be this pet's animation. You could, like, shoot out of a cannon or something and it, like, explodes against the opponent. <laughs> that would be pretty cool, too. All right, let me feed it a tomato because I want to get that intellect up a little bit. Deathblade. Not so bad. May cast Deathblade. I can think of worse talents indeed. Mega Hurry, which is its epic, nice, epic race. Plus 100 speed to self. 50 second cooldown. Woo-ha! That is looking good. All right. That is Zoe's adult level. I will be back very, very shortly with the ancient level, and we will see what happens next. And here we are at Zoe's ancient level. I have to say, this pet training seems like it has gone much, much faster than they usually do. I think, though, that it's because I'm so excited about the whole prospect of the thing. And I, as so far, I've seen so far... You kind of expect this pet to perform well. It's just been doing so well. Let me see what we got here this time. See if I shot that right or not. I was kind of wondering about that or not. That's such a touchy shot right there. You have to hit it just on the edge of those ice blocks. And I wasn't sure I was going to make it. And I would hate for my pet to fail because I did a bad job. That would be no good. All right, let's see what we got here. Come on. And I'm going to give him another cherry tomato because I want to get the intellect. It's almost done. Oh, no! <laughs> Oh no, I got pips. Pip of plenty. Come on, Zoe, don't do me like that. No. Okay, I also got big check, which is negative 30 speed to leader, 30 second cooldown, and the ancient socket. All right, I will be right back with the next segment. I got to check for something really quick because I got so many videos going at once that 
that I kind of have to stop right a minute to keep track. If I can't finish this up right now, I will be back with it tomorrow. Give me one second to check. Okay, guys, my next render is up and ready for upload. And while I'm uploading, I can't film. It puts too much of a lag on the whole system. So I'm going to continue this pet tomorrow. Guys, if you enjoyed part one of this, you know what? Before I do that, let me show you what all it got. Like, just like I'm really, I'm getting so excited. I'm getting ahead of myself. He got 